I'm alive! I ended up switching hostels for the night, so I'm at Hanoi Centre Hostel. Um, it's pretty close to the flip side, it's just a little further south. And so now that I'm refreshed, showered, I'm gonna go out and explore Hanoi for the day. And then tomorrow I leave for Kappa. One of the big things that Hanoi is known for is this train street, but they've done a lot of changes to it. This place used to be super popular. There used to be cafes up and down the train streets, and they're pretty restricted right now. And I know it's hard for me, you guys, to hear me, but yeah, so train street is not what it used to be. So I'm not going to lie when I say it's a little harder to navigate through Hanoi than my town in Thailand because it's like a thousand times bigger and crazier. One of the things that I've been told to do in Hanoi is to come and take a look at the St. Joseph's Cathedral which is very similar to the Notre Dame in Paris. Another thing to do in Hanoi is to go to this famous pagoda in the middle of one of the lakes and there's I guess a red bridge that is supposed to be really pretty so I'm at the lake and that's what I'm doing right now. So there's that famous red bridge. Don't know anything about it. Let's go see if I can find out some history. So I don't know anything about this place. Um, like I said I didn't really do too much research with Hanoi so yeah but there's the entrance, and then there's something over there, and then you can see behind me the red bridge.
I can honestly say I don't like crossing the street here in Hanoi. I'm trying to get there and I have to cross this. It's the Ho Chi Minh Mausoleum. One last thing, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and I'll see you on my next adventure.